Some of you have been asking what does it take to run live streaming over the internet, particularly for WBNI Christian Radio. Well, here's some of the instruments that I use in equipment on a nice panoramic view. First of all, I have what they call a software for the actual broadcast, and I use SAM Broadcaster Pro along with the server from Shoutcast or Caster FM. Also, as you notice, you have to have a microphone or a good headset with a microphone. I use a Blue Yeti Studio mic there, along with a microphone on my headset, stereo headset, to monitor what's going on. I have a CD player, which is plugged into a Behringer 16 input multi-facet uh, USB processor. Various preamps in there for microphones, and again, additional equipment that you may want to add in the mix. You can even add musical instruments, and you can have yourself a, some uh, pretty nice uh, little recording studio if you'd like. I have a 750 gig computer backup, which I use for the programming of the actual music and various uh, podcasts that uh, I use. And along with that, I have a monitor which actually monitors what's going on and goes out over the air here. The type of music, we have also various gauges that go along with that for the right and left stereo channels. And uh, I also have some stereo speakers there that I use to monitor the broadcast if I want to uh, not listen through the headphones all day. Plus a small camera which Obviously, I don't use for the radio station, but I do use to make various other things that goes along with promos. Uh, clocks, timers, that type of thing uh, we use a lot of. And when you put all that together and have yourself an internet provider, that's what it takes to do live broadcasting over the internet. Just a small video to show you what goes on behind the scenes.